Hey there! Today we're going to make a pencil case for these beautiful color pencils from Erijotin by Tombow that we picked up from DickBlick.com. We're also using this beautiful wool felt that we got from AChildsDream.com and you will also need some tape and a sewing machine for this project. So first up I'm pulling this beautiful red wool felt that measures 18 inches square and we're going to sew in a pocket that's 5 inches deep. So I'm just pinning this in place and then I'm going to use some tape in order to mark off pockets that are 6 inches wide. And I'll come back in later to make smaller pockets for the pencils, but right now I just want to divide this piece of wool felt into three sections. So I'm sewing up both sides and I'm using the um, the tape as a guide in order to sew a straight line at six inches. So once this is done I can come back in with some larger tape to mark off the pockets and I'm doing this instead of marking on the felt directly because I don't want to leave any pencil marks on my felt and so luckily this washi tape that's about an inch wide works well to make pockets and these pockets are going to be big enough to hold two pencils in each pocket rather than one pencil and so all together it can hold 30 pencils and that works perfectly because these sets have 10 pencils in each one. So that's what it looks like when it's all finished and the pencils slide in and out of the pockets really easily. So I'm putting this butterfly on this pencil case so that we can know who it belongs to because we have a lot of pencil cases and we just like to keep track of what's inside them. And so here are the pencil cases and um, I also wanted to show you how I keep my pencil cases and they're all in this red tin that I got from Target years ago and I'm just showing you a couple of the other ones that we have and some of them are marked just with a C or a W just to indicate whether they have color pencils in them or watercolor pencils. So I want to show you the first one that I made today that ended up not going so well. So I'm making a pencil case for these watercolor pencils and I am using this um, pencil case as a guide and in this pencil case there was room for each pencil in one pocket. And so I'm going to choose this yellow um, felt for our pencil case and I'm again going to make the pocket five inches deep. So this time I'm measuring out half inch increments throughout the whole um, piece of felt so that each pencil can have its own pocket because there are 36 pencils. So I'm using pencil to do this and this ends up being a big mistake because the pencil doesn't come off. And so I'm marking each line and it's great for sewing. I sewed some amazingly straight lines but the pencil didn't come off. But luckily I decided to sew um, every other pocket just so that I wouldn't um, pull the felt in one direction just to keep the felt even and that ended up being a good thing because as I began to sew in the individual pockets I quickly realized that they were going to be too small and so I only had to remove two of the pockets and then the rest were fine and so now I can fit two pencils in each pocket and there I was trying to erase the line with an eraser but it didn't really work but it's okay, um, the, you can still see the pencil marks but they're not so dark and the thing is I had used pencil in the past with a darker color felt and it didn't show up as much and so I thought it would be okay to use it this time but anyway, thanks for watching guys